Hey guys, Willow here, and today I'm back for another video on Call of Duty Black Ops 3. This time I'm on the Xbox One playing it. Um, yeah, so I've got all this done. I did spend a long time actually getting these um, these two things, the contracts. I've only just completed it. And I thought I'll open them on the recording and then use what I get in this weapon drive in a video. So, I'll start off with the 10 weapons, uh, the 10 normal bribes. It's not bad, 7 crypto key bonus. Might actually end up with another another one at the end of it. Oh, oh okay. Well, that's quite a nice Reaper head theme. I'll equip that. I quite like all this stuff. This is really nice to do. Alright. I had no idea what that is. <laughs> um, when I actually started up... Oh, that's nice. Um, when I started up the game... Um... I actually got like one of these, and the guns I got was the Marshall 16, which I now have dual wield, the wrench, and the axe, and I've made some pretty cool camos. I think I may have done that a bit too fast. I'm hoping for the new some new weapons. That's pretty weird. Yeah, I've got enough crypto uh, quad point. Yeah, things. That's a body. I was sort of hoping I'd get a weapon, honestly. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to open one more, then do the weapon bride, then open this, the next one. So, weapon bride, I'm going to close my eyes. One, two, three. Oh, brass knuckles. Oh, no. Come on, please give me a weapon. <laughs> Oh, intensity came up. Ah! Alright. Come on, weapons! As a camo, isn't it? Oh, no, it's a head thing. Oh, Alright, I'm gonna open two more normal ones. Oh, that's sort of depressing. I really wanted to get a new, another new weapon. I was hoping for the DSP 50. I actually used it, it's fucking brilliant. Yeah. Alright then. Well. <laughs> oh, God, I have that one. Alright, let's have a look. What did I put on battery? And for the emo one. Yeah, I'm going to put that one on. Honestly, it's sort of disappointed, really. I was really hoping to get a nice new gun. And instead I got brass knuckles. But oh well. Right, so. I think I'm going to put these down as melee weapon classes. So I'm going to put brass knuckles here. Knife. The axe, which is one of my favourite camos on it. It's only that side, but it's quite a nice gun, one. MR6. Uh, I haven't put the wrench on yet, so I'll do that. And then just fists here, I guess. So, yeah, I'm going to be using the brass knuckles then. Let's go on to a game of Team Deathmatch. Uh, I'd spent a lot of time doing that. I'm sort of sad that I only actually got one weapon because, like I said, I was quite enjoying these. And I have just done 75 matches, which took a few days of me playing, like, properly to do. But I did get brass novels. I suppose it's not half bad. 
I mean, I can save up and get a few more um, rare supply drops. Yeah, yeah. I can save up and get a few more. I hope the camera looks okay. It's sort of at an angle. Yeah, I hope that all looks okay. Yeah, I was sort of hoping for the DSP-50. I've used both the Peacekeeper Mark II and the DSP-50 and the um, fucking Batten thing. Um, I have to say, the DSP-50 is one of the best ones I've actually used. Why the fuck does it look like this? I'm pretty sure I put a camo on it, didn't I? Ah. Yeah, I used the DSP-50. And where it's double barreled, it actually, like, one-shot um, the enemy. So it's very strong as it is. Oh, bastards. I should have seen that coming, actually. Yeah, I picked it up and got a quad feed with it, actually. Oh, this is going to be an annoying game, isn't it? Oh. Yeah, I do try to use all the guns, all the weapons I possibly can. If I do see a Peacekeeper or a DSP-50 on the floor, I do pick it up. Just because they're quite nice guns to use, actually. The SP-50 isn't exactly a strong weapon. But it's not weak either. It's sort of like... Mm, I don't know what I'd mark it as. It's a weird. It's not really an assault rifle. But then it's not... It, it's a mixture of both. I know it's a mixture of both, but it's not in the same... In a sense. Stop camping. Oh. Oh, bastard! Nah, man. I thought if I did the overdrive, that would be good. But yeah, I do have a few spare COD points just from the fact of I bought the um, extra um, class kits. There's like way I could do stuff like this. Ah! The girl gun's a really annoying gun. Actually, the last game. The gun. Alright, I'm gonna say straight up. Oh, fuck. Um. Games I suggest actually you doing to get this. Um, hardcore, if you can play hardcore. I can't play hardcore, so I'm terrible at it. Um, if you can play hardcore, hardcore. Um, team deathmatch is like I'm saying here. Oh, fuck you. Yeah, team deathmatch like I'm playing here. I find that if you if you just um, cycle through games... Um, play like one match in each game unless you win if you lose you play one match yeah, if you lose you play one match sorry I keep going off ah not doing too bad. My ratio is always terrible. Um, but I suggest using um, one sec. I'll just pull them up real quick. Actually, no, I can't. Um, I suggest having an RPG secondary, whether it be the black cell or yeah, whether it be the black cell or the normal RPG. I prefer the normal one because it's actually a viable use in a vessel. Ah! Um, the KM44 is always pretty good. Um, well, yeah, it is actually always pretty good. I suggest um, putting like rapid fire, long barrel, FMJ, and then um, high caliber. Um, yeah, something like that, just because they're actually very useful. <sighs> yeah, FMJ and high caliber in the can. And the same with the HVK. That's actually very viable for using, especially with um, rapid fire. Um, I do suggest you try and use some um, some submachine guns as well. I know he saw me there. Yeah, um, some I suggest either the Cuda or the VMP. 
For some reason, I feel like the guns have got a uh, submachine guns have got a buff, but it doesn't feel like it when I actually use them. So I don't know whether it's that they have or whether it's just me being stupid, uh, me not being able to use them and all that. So don't oh, fuck. I got someone. Yeah, I, I'm not a very melee influenced person. So I don't actually use melee weapons very often. Like I say, I make the nice cameras for them, but that's because I can. Like with the uh, T Rex. Yeah, with the, that with the T Rex. Oh, there's muscles. Sorry, whenever I, pick, I see a weapon like these, I pick them up because they're quite nice. In the middle of a gunfight. Very close range. Ah, shit, I tried to switch up and hit the other guy. Okay. Um, yeah, it really just depends on what sort of variant you are. Don't snipe if you're off the wind streaks. Sniping is like the worst thing you can possibly do. Um, shotguns are okay, especially in um, certain mode. What the fuck? I hit him. Um, especially in certain modes. Um, yeah, I suggest using shotguns really in close range maps. Mainly you're going to stick with assault rifles, like, like I said, the HK is probably the best. With the AN coming in close second. Um, just use really what you feel comfortable with. Don't snipe, it's like the worst thing you could, you could do. Oh, fuck you! See that, he literally walked through them. Oh, fuck off. Fuck you, you colonial bastard. Don't know why I said that. Um, yeah, if you get into a game where it's like this, don't... Um, I, I would say finish it off and then leave the match because me mostly it means that you're stuck with some inexperienced people. Um... I know you can always check it here. Um, for some reason, I don't know why, but I'm ranked with very high people. Like, look at this. I'm 13 and 17, and look at this. Oh, fuck, I thought that was an, a team, uh, an enemy, not a team. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm ranked second because of, look at this. But, how the fuck am I meant to compete with this guy? It's ridiculous. Yeah. So if you find a game where there's like several level 100s, don't stick around, it's like the worst thing you can do. Just leave the match, find another one, it will never put you in the same match in a row. So you're basically guaranteed a different game. You may get put in the match after that, so if you just do my cycle through them. Uh, also, gun game. Ah, fuck. Um, I'm not used to using it though. Yeah. Gun game is one of the best. I find gun game to be very intense and it sort of gets me really wild up so I cannot play, I can play like two games of gun game. Fuck. Yeah, I can play like two games of gun game. Oh, as long as you're good at using all the guns, I'd say get, do your best to get to, um, get to the, what? Well, oh. get to the Gorgon, and then you're basically set, okay? Because once you get to the Gorgon, not, try and make it past the Gorgon, not a lot of people can. The Shiva is also very difficult to get past. Yeah, we lost that. Um, the Shiva is very difficult to get past. So, basically, you're fine for that sort of thing. Just always try your best, really. That's all I can really say. Um, cycle through games, look for the winners. You want to try and win 75 games. It's not easy. I'm not in the slightest is it easy. So if you do want something like that, just yeah. I'm hoping that I do get some cool new weapons because, like I said, I have the I have all those in the Marshall. I've picked up the other ones. I've picked up the Lagachi. Honestly, the Rift D9 isn't half bad either. I'm gonna leave this match as well. Um, but yeah, just 
use whatever guns you want. Play team deathmatch, hardcore modes, or gun game. I won't really suggest any of the others. Um, camos on the other hand is different. That's everything is different in the way you get them. For winning games like that, that's easy. As long as you're an actual good player and not fucking free. Which I have been in maps where there have been kids just talking on the other on my team and I've had to mute them all because they kept asking me, "Oh, can you die? Can you kill yourself so I can use your brass knuckles? Well, not brass knuckles, but the marshals and stuff like that." And it's sucking annoying. Any weapon I have that they don't have, they keep going, "Oh, can you just quickly hold a grenade so that we can do them?" It's like, "No, sorry, man, I don't have any grenades." And it's like later on they see me throw a grenade. It's like, "Oh, you lied." Um. Yeah, these are the, these are the guns I use. I've got max out cam, max out HP. I'm trying different shotguns. Honestly, the Argus isn't the best, but I have this nice camo for it. Oh, I've got another one. That's terrible. I prefer that one. Um, yeah, the Argus is sort of okay if you're accurate. I'm not very. Um, the Marshall 16. Like I said, I've got it to max. I don't. I didn't really go for anything um, super um, like terrible on the camo. I did have that, and it was going to work with the Bliss. But actually, I preferred that uh, without a camo on. It's quite nice, actually, I find. Because it just sort of darkens the gun. It has this nice dark pink on the top. Don't know. It, I've been playing a lot of Overwatch. Um, this was terrible camo. But, yeah, it just... Oh, wait, what? Huh. Yeah, I've actually maxed out my Ruin character. So the only thing I'm missing is the Vikings, which I've done one on. But I actually have quite a few things to do. And the gravity spikes, which are not easy to do at all. Yeah. Um, you just what you feel comfortable with. That's my rule. That's what I say. Black market is not easy to get jack shit off of, as seen. I don't know when these reset. I don't know when the special resets. I'm sort of hoping it's soon. Because... As you see, I've done everything but the daily. I'm guessing it'll be like tomorrow or something like that, or like in a few hours. But mm, it's difficult to say. I'm not too sure. I'm still quite new to the game, even if I am level 49. I've had this game since like last Friday. Um, yeah, my my clan is Trace. If you ever want to join it. Just make sure you don't just like say it. Leave in the comment if you're going to do it with your name or that so that I know you're actually with me. Um, yeah, it's sort of weird. Yeah, I was really hoping for one of the new guns. The R70 isn't like shit. Don't get it. If you do get it, it's shit, so don't bother. Uh, campaign stuff is boring as all hell, even if I am level 6. Uh, zombies is very different. I have all these gobble guns really. Unbearable is sort of terrible. I've never actually used it. Um, I'm not doing too bad for gobble guns. I do have one pug colic and one killing time. And these were simply from the ones that I got when I started the, you know, the year 10 when you start if you had the season pass. That's what I use. I got three no lights, got a fucking pug colic on the house, temporal gift which I'm never going to use. Although it was there and again, I've never used unbearable. Crawl space isn't half bad. Yeah, but you sort of need a lot of cobble gums really to do stuff. Yeah, like that. Oops. Well, it seems I have clicked on fucking zombies. Didn't actually mean to click on zombies, and I'm gonna speak over the fucking cutscene. Great. Yeah, didn't actually mean to do this. I was actually going to show you that I had the season pass and show you um, all the maps I have and how good I am on some of them. Shadows, I, c I can do high rounds on shadows. If you ever want me to do a high round attempt on shadows, this is fucking creepy ass cutscene. I also really weirdly experience um, textures in this. Like, you just saw that terrible in. The gun was fucking weird. If you guys didn't know. Don't 
Don't actually do this. This is like a waste of your points, really. I do this if I'm after a certain thing. Yeah, if you just want to get uh, experience, this is what I suggest you do. I've gone really fucking silent. Um, sorry. It's weird. I don't usually go silent like this. I feel like I need to sneeze. <laughs> Ugh. If you guys have ever been in the water and like inhaled the water through your nose, that is the feeling I just got. That was really fucking weird. Alright, there we go. Oh, I need to get triple and kills, which I don't know if I'll be able to do. Oh, great. Fuck you. Fuck you, you bastards. Kill, kill! Yeah, five kills! <laughs> yeah, I need to get that sort of stuff. Um, I just wanted to show you the match. I didn't actually mean to double tap, hey? Um, yeah, leave in the comments. I do have a few games on here now. I have Assassin's Creed Syndicate, which is one of my favourites. This, which if you ever want to see zombies or more multiplayer or different, me playing different game modes, like if you want to see me play Uplink or Fracture or any of those, leave a comment saying, I have got a comment from a few people saying they want to do collaboration with me, although they're not very high high class YouTubers either, they're just sort of friends that have gone, oh you want to do this because I know you have a channel, and honestly I'm debating what to do, I'm meant to be doing it uh, with one of my friends, Instinct Gaming, and me and him were meant to, um, yeah, me and him were meant to do stuff like this. And he has sort of disappeared off YouTube for a while. So yeah, just wanted to show you the map. So I've got the gate where I'm on only one map, and that's a giant, and that's easy, so. Um, yeah, it's because I have no friends to do it with. Anyway, yeah, I have Black Ops 3, AC Unity, which I'm guessing no one wants to see, uh, Assassin's Creed at Syndicate, as shown. What? I'm confused. Um, yeah, it got an update the other day. And now I don't know where my fucking games are. Okay, I'm gonna have a search for this. So they didn't. If you don't know, they added um, Cortana into Xbox, which isn't the best. I have to say. Um, yeah, yeah, not the best thing in the world, I'd say. Um, right. If you guys don't know, um, all the films that have come out, so they've got Batman. Man v Superman that's coming out. Um, quite a lot of actual nice games are coming out. Again, I do suggest a uh, film that I suggest you watch. Sorry, films. Um, all games. How do I see my games? I wonder if it has something to do with Fortnite. One sec. Yeah, I'm hoping it's something to do with my games. I hope they didn't just jack up, because it just said that there was a storage problem. I hope it's not too fucked up with the recording. I have to edit that soon. Come on. Xbox Snap Games. Hey Cortana, take me to my games. No. Hey Cortana, take me to my games. I'll 
Fuck you, Wardana. Fuck off. Ugh. I'm gonna have to fucking look this up, aren't I? Thing is, I have quite a few games. So I have Black Ops One, Overwatch, Black Ops Three. The actually, the the the, the two good asset. Well, eh, the one good Assassin's Creed on this console. The other somewhat okay Assassin's Creed on this console with a ton of glitches. Um. Um, a lot of people actually had trouble finding me on YouTube, and it's sort of worthless me saying. But just type in my um, yeah, just type in my sort of gamer tag, which is just Willow two nine zero seven. There, it's the best thing you can do. A lot. I killed five zombies. Give me a fucking twenty percent. Um, yeah, I don't plan on proceeding. If any of you guys actually would like something, I may do a game where I'm actually playing with subscribers. So if any of you guys actually have Black Ops 3 on the Xbox um, One, which most people do, or they have an Xbox One, um, feel free to just comment saying that, and what I may do at some point is just upload a video saying, hey guys, I'm going to do this and this, and if you guys want to come along at this time, then we'll do that. I'm also going to do some more zombies and more, some more Pokemon. Also guys, if you like Pokemon Go, you're a terrible Pokemon player. Simple as. It's got no story. It's a terrible game. Don't play Pokemon Go. Unless you're like being bugged to go outside by your mum all the time and have made to go walk around parks. Then you play Pokemon Go. But it's a fucking boring game. So don't buy it. Don't like waste any fucking real money on it. And only play it then. It's not worth playing if you're doing fucking... I don't know. If you, if you have the option of playing Pokemon um, Omega Ruby or Alpha Sapphire compared to playing Pokemon Go, take the Ruby and Sapphire and the 3DS and go sit down and fucking play it while watching Netflix or whatever the fuck TV you want to watch. Because let's face it, Pokemon Go is shit and stupid and dangerous. And if you are going to play Pokemon Go, listen to the warnings. Be very safe while doing it. Don't fucking stop in the middle of highways. And... Please learn the pronunciation of the fucking Pokemon. Simple as. It's not a Caterpie, it's a Caterpie. It's not a Vaporeon, it's a Vaporeon. I fucked that up because I was meant to say Vaporeon. It's not a Vaporeon, it's a Vaporeon. It's not a Jilteon, it's a Jolteon. It's not a fucking Dragonite. It's a Dragonite. Or Goridos. The fuck is Goridos? Sounds like fucking Gary fucking banged Gariados and then fucking gave their offspring. Gariados. Uh. Also, I don't care what team you are. Don't give a fuck about Team Mystic, Valor, or Instinct. Team Psycho. Team Psycho, Bridge. Team Psycho, we have the legendary Mewtwo. You guys are fucked. Enjoy when the legendaries are released. That's all I can say. Uh, this has just been a fucking rant at the end of this. I'm going to label this supply drop opening three legendaries in one. I don't care. Bye, guys. There shall be more videos, I swear. <laughs> Alright, see you later.